everybody it's me again crazy bag lady it's monday morning oh i really don't like monday mornings and it's literally five to eight and we've got to leave in like 10 minutes because i've got to take my stupid car to the garage so bert is not very well again i really don't like bert anymore I'm thinking about selling him if anybody wants to buy bert um so he's got i don't know some sort of bearing or something that's got to be done so i've got to take it to the garage uh my husband has left an old one of his older cars near the garage so i've got to drive bert to the garage remember the key and then drop the car off with like the workmen and stuff which is horrifying because i hate going to garages on my own um and then get the key and then walk to the older car and then come home which to some people couldn't care less but to me i'm like oh, i don't want to do this <laughs> i hate being an adult so we've got to be there for like hopper state so i really need to work because it's about half an hour away from where i live so weather i think it's gonna be nice in a bit but at the minute it's a bit cloudy morning me beautiful flora pat peggy and everybody positive potato literally looks how i feel so i was reading my book till half past 12 and then obviously i had to get up early and it's like jane why do you do this to yourself but when i start reading a book and it's quite good i, I can't stop <laughs> and i look at the time and i think oh i've got to get up <laughs> so if you're having a positive potato moment like this today you're not alone i'm definitely there with you i feel horrible uh anxious stressed and even got like boob sweat and top lip sweat I feel a bit like sweaty <laughs> I don't know why uh well i do it's my age but anyway morning little bubble his little bubble hat um so calendar of the day we've got shine on <laughs> i like that it's lovely it's my favorite shade of pink and some beautiful red nails what more could you need on a monday i like that shine on everybody right so lovely chanel's pocket wisdom we've got in order to be irreplaceable, one must always be different. Don't ever forget that. Black Cab Wisdom. We've got... Um, when you change the way you look at things, the things you look at change. Changing your mind proves you've got one. And you're never too old to make positive change. Okay. Jane, you really like mornings. I was born on a Monday morning, unbelievably. I don't think I've liked them ever since. <laughs> right, we need to chuck some clothes on and get going. Right, and away we go. It's so early. I've had no breakfast or anything. I thought, just go, because you're right in my late. Let's go. Right, I'm in the little blue car. Get me home. It's quarter to nine. I need to go home and have my breakfast. And definitely need a cup of tea. <laughs> I've made it back. My friends are like, wow, you've been out early. <laughs> right, I've not made my bed or anything, so now I need to do all my little jobs. I've got to make my bed, make a cup of tea, get some breakfast. Right, so before I forget, we tried these last night. They were nice. But they're not as nice as the chocolate brownie ones. The chocolate brownie ones were amazing. These are still nice, but they're not as nice as the other ones. Right, breakfast. So breakfast this morning, we've got uh, is it special K with berries in and a little fleet for my friends. Right, so the only friend that I can see is Florence, dedicated foodie. Right, there you go, my dear. <laughs> Don't know where all your other friends have disappeared to. Nine, 27. <laughs> I need to get out of the chair. I've got so much to do. Right, come on, Janie, motivate yourself. <laughs> okay, so we're back in Ruby's bedroom. So, obviously, this is a, I think it's like a 1970s shelly bungalow. Um, so, obviously, it's had lots of decorating over the years. Uh, we've decorated a couple of times here, but we didn't do the yellow. Um, but there's, like, holes where shelves and stuff have been. And because Ruby wants the, the walls painting... Um, obviously you need, to try and, you need to try and get the walls as best as possible so today I'm going to fill in the holes I'm no expert filling at all but I don't mind doing it 
<clears throat> so I'm going to fill in the holes and then I'm also going to try and disguise this bloody horrible square around the light switch which I think at some point they must have had you know like you can get um or it was fashionable to have like a board around the plug hole or some plug hole around the light switch or something I don't really know but it's just got this horrible square and I absolutely hate it so if we'd got wallpaper it would hide it all it would be lovely but like I say it doesn't want wallpaper <laughs> so I'm wondering if I can put some like filler over it to try and like hide it a bit because I think even if it's a little bit bumpy it would probably be better than a square um I don't know but we'll try I'll see what I can do and then obviously I've got to wash the walls down um I've got to finish stripping behind a bed can't finish stripping up there because I can't move the wardrobe um yeah still lots of work to do <sighs> Monday morning fun so I've got to get down there bloody Ruby she was supposed to finish that and she didn't and then there's more holes over here and then there's a blooming pipe i think or some sort of wire that somebody had done at some point and it it's horrible so even when i paint this wall you're probably still going to see the shape of it isn't it horrible i don't know if i'm actually stuck <laughs> i can't turn that way around um i can only stand sideways and i've had to hook my leg over there oh dear i've wet it on just wait a minute for it to soak and then try and strip it I feel like I'm being swallowed by the bed and the wall. <laughs> this is not where I want to be on a Monday morning. Okay, so I've unsqueezed myself out there. I've done that. It is now a couple of minutes to 11. So I think we need a cup of coffee and we'll go and find my filler and my tools. Oh, and I also forgot. I've got to wash it out. It was spitting with rain on the way back from the garage. Um, and it's not really that sunny now, but I'm hoping it'll dry. Next load of washing's going in. <laughs> I didn't realise that Dolly was on my little sofa in the conservatory. I turned around and realised something was watching me. My little friend, look at her tired little face. Oh, you look how I feel. Much needed coffee to keep us going. Be happy. Okay, so because the walls are so crap, my husband said if I tried to pull out the raw plugs, it would make a real mess. So I'm going to smack them with a hammer to make them flat. I've got a pink hammer lot. I've had it a very, very long time. I think I bought it from like the pound shop, but it's actually been really good. Um, so I'm going to... And then it sort of makes them smoother. I'll probably do this bloody wall or probably fall down. Right, we'll do that. So we've got lots to do. Another one here. We've got to love a bit of DIY. Right, we we'll fill it in. So I filled that one in, that one in, uh, that one in, and I've still got a couple to do over there. Are you helping me? Mm. So I've probably kind of made it a little bit worse maybe, but I filled it in and then I thought when it's dry, I'll get some sandpaper and sand over it and it perhaps won't look quite so noticeable as a big square around the plug. Not plug, light switch. Mm. Right, so as you know, I want to make an outdoor picture using some filler. And I've just, <laughs> I've been looking for outdoor filler everywhere, right? I've already got this filler. And I've just read on it, you can use this one outdoors. And I swear, I've looked at this tin a million times and it didn't say you could use it outdoors. <laughs> so I don't need to buy any more. If I do, I can just buy another tin of this. I have got one more tin upstairs as well. I can't believe it. I was like, I've looked at so many tins thinking you couldn't get an outdoor one and you can use this one outdoors. That's very annoying. I'm dying to sand it. I think Jane, leave it alone, it's got to dry. <laughs> I'm just scared I've made it worse. I'm down to sand it to like smooth it all off a bit. Oh, I'll try to touch that up. That up. Have I made it all worse? I don't know. Hmm. And the door frame's a bit crappy as well along here. So I'm wondering if I can, I did buy some like sealer because I did it when I did the kitchen and ran up like a line of sealer down here, which made it look a million times better. So I'm wondering if I can find that in the garage. Ooh. I found some. Hey! <laughs> Right, let's give this door a sealer. Mm. So it's not perfect, but 
it's a lot lot smoother and then i think when i paint over it um it'll blend in so much better dinner so dinner say i've got two slices of danish white bread with some chicken cranberry chicken for my friends and another cup of coffee <laughs> look how when he sits <laughs> bless her look at little feet oh my tea was lovely right florence dolly winifred winifred no no oh. My dog may be old and frail and unsteady on her legs, but when there's a piece of chicken on the floor, <laughs> it's just like a bloody speedy, speedy Gonzalez. Right, Winifred, shall I find you another piece of chicken? You're lucky I've got a tiny bit in the fridge. Right, you couldn't make it up, could you? No, it's not for you lot, it's for Winnie. Go away. Right, Winifred, no. No. Hey, I want to eat it quick. Got it? Well done. You, you naughty, greedy little thing, aren't you? Hey, yeah, hard like, isn't it, Winnie? Where's your paw, Dolly? Paw? Where's your paw? Paw? Oh, good girl. Are you good girl? Where's your paw? 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 <laughs> good girl. Lipstick of the day. So, lipstick of the day is the Ad Adrian <laughs> Avon Hydra lipstick in colour blush. Really lovely summer colour. So the sun hasn't come out here. I know it has in other places in the UK, but at the minute we've definitely got no sun. I've just remembered I've got a man coming this afternoon as well to look at my back fence. So the f the other man that came looked at the back fence and all the banking that's fallen away and I never heard from him again. And that was like, what, three or four weeks ago now? So I've got another man coming today. Of course I'm here on my own again. I really don't want to deal with it, but I've got to put my adult pants on. <laughs> um, so he's coming this afternoon. I think he said between three and four, look, between three and four. Um, so I'm in Nip's shop now, I need to get some milk. Um, my neighbor's paper. My neighbor's just from me up, left an answer message, waffling on about her grandson's bought some plants and can I put them in the garden for her? No, not at the minute, I'm busy. <laughs> you should have got your grandson to put them in the ground. That sounds horrible, I don't mean it horribly, but I've got so much to do and I think it's all right a grandson buying us some plants, but really he should have put them in and not expected me to put them in the garden. So I can't do it anyway at the minute, my back's too bad and I'm busy decorating Ruth's bedroom. Um, so I've got a fetch her paper and I need to get some salad for tea and a cup of other bits. So I think we'll nip to shop now so that we're here in plenty of time for this man coming. If he even comes, because I know a lot of workmen say they come in and then they don't even show up. So I'm hoping he will. He did text me again say he was coming the other day, so I'm fingers crossed he'll come. Um, let's hope he'll have a little bit of a solution and not just run away <laughs> and never be seen again. Right, let's go. Right, I've got my milk, got my name's paper. I'm so tired. <laughs> I really am tired today, it's horrible. That morning thing's really done me head in. Um, and I think at some point, if my car's ready, I've then got to go back and fetch it. <laughs> I think my husband's gone to Scotland today. I'm not sure where he's gone, but I think it was a long way. I'm sure he went up to Scotland again. He goes all over, he's always in Scotland. Um, right, so I think I'll go and shove my neighbour's paper through, come back, see if I've got some sandpaper, and then I'm gonna sand the walls wash the side walls down with um what do you call it uh, sugar soap stuff to get like the paste off and then i think that side wall will be ready for painting um yeah Ooh, that's come around quick ready for painting already Right, so I'm trying to look for some paper. <laughs> I know, we all like to have cuddles, don't we? I know, yes. Yes, very needy, aren't you? Little needy Nelly. Should have called you Nelly. Nelly needy. <laughs> yes, I know, you're beautiful, yes. Love you very, very much. Beautiful, yes. That's what you, when you're you give me a nice little lovely cough. <laughs> right, so I've found some sandpaper. Oh, and the sun's coming out. I feel the sun on my head. Lovely. The sun coming out. Right. Let the fun begin. It's all nice and smooth. Right. 
so I've sanded all this. I don't know if I've made it better or not, and I won't know, I don't think, till I've painted it. So obviously you can still see the square at the minute, but it, you can't feel it. So I'm thinking when I paint it, it might blend in a bit more. I really hope so, because that really spoils it when you walk into the room. Fingers crossed. Right, okay, next job. So I thought before I wash the wall down i think i'm better to hoover up the dust otherwise again going to get like wet sticky dust everywhere so i've got mr shark i need to hoover it up now it's wallpaper everywhere as well from when we stripped it yesterday oh decorating does make a mess there's bits everywhere look oh dear and we've got rainbows on the floor hope that's lucky for us right so i was in the middle of hoovering and doorbell went and the man came about the field and the banking and stuff so at least he came he came early but at least he came he was really nice he's told me he's given me the phone number of a structural engineer that he deals with so he said get him to come out and have a look and he was dead truthful he said it can be sorted but obviously it needs doing properly um so I've got to ring another man now, but he came, hallelujah. <laughs> it's a miracle if you can get somebody just to come now, but he did come and it was lovely, bless him. So now we need to make some more phone calls and then finish the hoover. Right, I've hoovered up. So it's 20 past four. Um, I'm just having a cup of coffee and then I need to wash Ruby's wall down. So then I know that wall is ready for uh, painting. I'm worn out, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know about Bert, I've not heard anything if he's been fixed or not, bless him. <sighs> I actually don't like wiping walls down. I think it's horrible. <laughs> but you can see like the old paste on it. So I've got a bottle of sugar soap and I'm trying to scrub the walls so that when I do paint it, the paint will go on better and not be like lumpy. Right, next job. Uh, get the washing in. <sighs> I'm boiling now. I've washed all that wall down. The tea is in the oven. That's why my little foodie friend's here. And my hubby's just wrong, and Bert's not ready. So Bert... Won't be coming home today, bless him. Right, dinner! So dinner tonight, we've got uh, chicken burgers with salad and pop chips. Um, I've just weighed them out. Here's my pop chips. Off to enjoy it. Right, oh, are you ready? It's Lovely, jubbly. <laughs> right, hang on, your door shut. There you go. And is it going to rain? I don't think it is, but it looks a bit cloudy over there. And my ironing pile is getting massive. Ugh, it'll have to wait for another day, though. I'm not sure what sort of manoeuvre that is. That's, I've eaten my tea and I'm going to sit with my bum in there. <laughs> What are you doing? You're doing your yoga? Well, oh, you are clever, aren't you? Can't believe another day has gone by and I've still not undone my chair. <laughs> right, me dears, I'm going to lovely leave you. So many thanks for joining me again today. Obviously, it's been a busy day of decorating this time. I love a bit of decorating, but it's all the bloody prep. I don't mind the actual painting and stuff, but it's all the beforehand, like filling mm -hmm. the holes in and the sanding, and it's all... Oh, it's boring and it's hard work and I don't like doing it. <laughs> so many thanks for being there with me. So if you do enjoy just a little bit of real life, then please subscribe to my channel. Come and find me on Instagram as Mrs. Crazy Bag Lady. My dogs have got Instagram, which is three fluffles. My website is down below. It's James still needs to sort out. My little Avon shop is also down below. So I love you and leave you. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. At least Monday's over and done with. See you.